Junie Tony Story Musical, Scrooge's Christmas Carol. Shall we start? Winter breezes in the air, warm joy is everywhere. Christmas, Christmas, everyone's a oh, happy day. And dicey, everyone's bothering me. Christmas. Stop sitting together! Christmas. Stop making noise! I hate presents, greetings, and everything! Christmas. What's there to like about Christmas? I hate, hate, and hate Christmas! I wonder why Mr. Scrooge hates Christmas. There must have been something. Junie and Tony decided to go back to Scrooge's past. Chippy, 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 choo! <laughs> Little Scrooge was decorating a Christmas tree. <laughs> mom, Dad, look at this! Scrooge, your mom and I are busy. You can stay home alone, right? Uh, uh... The time magic took Junie and Tony to a young man, Scrooge. Scrooge, you think money is more important than me. Goodbye. Everybody leaves me on Christmas. <sighs> Christmas is the worst day ever! He doesn't have any good memories about Christmas. Poor Mr. Scrooge. <laughs> Tony, let's let Mr. Scrooge know how happy Christmas is. Huh? Junie and Tony came back to the present, and they took Mr. Scrooge to his assistant Bob's house. <laughs> Bob, what are you doing in my house? What happened? Uh, it's because of our magic. Other people can't see us. Magic? Why? We wanted to show you how others celebrate Christmas. At that moment, Bob got up and told his family... This is all thanks to Mr. Scrooge. We celebrate Christmas once again. Thank you for the meal and thanks to Mr. Scrooge. Bless him. Thank you, Mr. Scrooge. Thank you, Mr. Scrooge. <laughs> of course. <laughs> 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 oh dear, my Timothy, take him to the hospital. Tomorrow I will, I will ask Mr. Scrooge again. Oh, I thought he was lying. His son is really sick. He needs money for his son. Come on, there's another place to go. <laughs> They arrived at Scrooge's nephew, Fred's house. <laughs> oh, happy holiday! Merry Christmas! <sighs> Uncle Scrooge rejected again. My oh my, Uncle Scrooge, he must be so lonely. Huh? Why did you not go? The poor guy is having a party? What a waste of money! I'll invite him every year, and he'll make it someday. I want my uncle to know the joy, the joy of Christmas with people around him. <laughs> Christmas with people? All they ask for is money for Christmas. 
It's best to be alone on Christmas. Hmm. Everyone is sincerely worried about you. You're too mean. You're too mean. Did I ask for it? Just take me back to my place now. Stop! Junie, Tony, and Scrooge arrived in front of a grave. Scrooge's nephew Fred and assistant Bob were sadly looking down at Scrooge's grave. Rest in peace, Uncle Scrooge. What? Is this my funeral? But where are all the others? Where are all the guys who borrowed money from me? Junie? We might have come to Mr. Scrooge's future. Mr. Scrooge, please take care of my son Tim in heaven. What? He died? Oh no, because I didn't give him money for his son? Scrooge was in shock. He regretted the days when he pushed out all the people around him. He realized that money was not so important. I... I didn't mean to be a person like this. What a lonely death. Why didn't I help the poor kid? Was... was it a dream? Scrooge came back to the present on a Christmas morning. He opened the window. It's not too late. I can change everything. Today is a whole new day, like I was born again. Cutting off grumpy, mean, and cranky chains. I will be a better me. Say hello to everyone. Merry Christmas! The mean old Scrooge is gone. I have changed. I am new. Older person, Mr. Scrooge. Is this a Christmas miracle? Miracle. Older person, Mr. Scrooge. Is this Christmas magic? Magic. Magic. that being together with others and helping someone would make me so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone is happy on Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> Judy, why don't we give presents to people? That's a great idea. Merry Christmas, everyone. May your days be merry and bright. <laughs> Junie Tony Story Musical. See you next time.